Good morning everyone. Happy Friday. Welcome to Kukureja Google by channel. Um, so uh, today I'm going to show you how to make a copy of uh, anything, a document, a spreadsheet, a PowerPoint, or uh, um, anything that you're making copy of that. And the different ways of making copy of that. If you are in the folder, if you're creating a new folder, if someone shared a document with you with viewing access, how to make a copy of that, just a very little um, a difference in each one of them. So I'm going to start with creating a new folder. So let's say I named the folder Google Bytes. I create a folder. I'm going to go. Um, this, this is the sign for the black folder, the sign for the Google by, um, folder. I'm going to click this. I'm going to create a new document. Here's my new document in Google Bytes. I'm going to name this Google Byte number two. So this is my document. Whatever I need to do, I'm going to type it up. I need a copy of this document. So I am going to make a copy file, make a copy. Very important to name the document correctly so you can find it and make sure it's in the same folder so that it's easier to find it. Okay. So now I want to see where did these copies go? I want to go back to, let's go back to my drive. Let's look for the folder. Google Bytes. It did not come up because I need to refresh my page. So now these are the these are the, the first one I created and the second one was the copy. It doesn't say copy because I renamed it um, Google Byte number three. So that's that's first part of making copy when you're doing anything from scratch. Now let's talk about it that I already have a folder and I just want to make a copy of a document. So let's say I go to my 2019-20 school year. I go to my PD folder where I put all the PDs. So let's say I want to create a document here in the folder. So now I'm not going to create a folder. I'm going to go to a folder that I already that already exists in my drive and I'm just going to create a document and follow the same. So let's say I created a document over here. So I name it byte number four. And then if I make a copy of this document, it stays in the same folder. So let's say I say byte number five. So you're going to see that these two documents, byte four and byte five, are going to be in this folder. So let's look for them. And sometimes it doesn't come right away because you need to refresh your page, byte four and byte five. So what was the difference in the first one and the second one? The first one I created right from the scratch. I didn't have the folder, so I created a folder. I created a document. Second one, I already had a folder. So go to that folder so you all of your documents are organized in that folder, but you follow the same procedure, make a document, make a copy of that. Okay, so third part, what happens if somebody shares a document with you and you need to make a copy of that? Exactly like this, you go to share it with me and uh, I don't know, I would have to find out something because I have right now so many shared with me documents. Um, let's see, these are the pictures um, students have been submitting work. Um, okay, let's pick one of the um, document over here. So if someone um, s shares with me, same thing. When I go make a copy of this, I name it byte number six. Now, this is the main um, trick that I want everybody to um, pay attention to that. This is something somebody shared with me. It's not in my drive. It's not in my home. I'm making a copy, but if I don't organize in the folder, it's going to be lost. And, I'm, I, and unless I do the advanced search, I won't be able to find it. 
and this is where I need to organize in my drive. So I'm going to come out of this and I'm going to go to my drive and I'm going to go to my school year and I'm going to look for the folder where I want to put it. Okay, let's say I want to put it in my PD folder. I want to put it in my PLC folder and this is where I am going to move it. So now the part is, how do I look for it when I made the copy of that? I'm going to go back to my full drive. You see the shared with me is highlighted. So that means I'm in shared with me right now. I need to go to my drive. That's my home. And I need to remember that I put in the school, remember, school year folder, PD folder, and let's go. Now I forgot. What, what did I... Um, PLC. This is where I put in there. Byte number six is right here. So three things. You start from scratch or you have a folder where you make a document and make a copy. Or when somebody shares a document with you, you make a copy, but you have to bring it to your drive and in the right folder where you can find it. Um, that's it today for Google Byte number two. Um, let me know if this little mini video was um, helpful to you. Um, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe my channel. Thank you all.